Yes, it's me again. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not talking too loud because I'm right in front of the phone and I always forget. All right, this next video is going to be um, auction wins from two different places. Well, three different places. Two are from um, YouTube and one is from Whatnot. So let me show you the Whatnot first, I guess. Um, no, let me show you. Hmm, I don't even know. Well, I'll just solve it out with the Whatnot. I got this from um, Treasure Hustlers. They sell it on Whatnot, and they have late night auctions. I'll put their link below for their Whatnot. And I got this rhinestone, and it has like a pale, pale pink jewel, and then clip earrings. They have a lot of high-end stuff. I mean, um, like Juliana and all that kind of stuff. So they go to estate sales and, but this was, you know, a nice rhinestone necklace. I don't think there's a name on it, but great, perfect time for proms and stuff, right? All right. The next item I got was a one-off thing and I got it from, uh, what do they call it? Coffee and, oh, I call her Bobby Crafts because that was her name. Coffee and chat with Bobby and Ken, I think. I'll put their link below and I had another video. But I bought um, an item from them. <laughs> Look at this. At first she goes, oh, I think it's a pig. I'm like, no, it's a leprechaun. I mean, um, St. Patrick's Day is over. But how adorable is this guy? I love him. And he's a little bit act articulated, you know what I mean? Like his head goes a little bit and most. This is adorable. I think it is adorable. So that's what I got from them. Now the third one is, um, oh, did they change their name too? I don't know. Jennifer Layton and her and her husband, John, do it. So I don't know if they, I think it's Jen and John Jules. I'll put their link below. So they're very nice. Everybody that I've bought from are friends that I've known for a long time. So um, yeah, I'll put Jen and Don stuff below. And I'm gonna, I did theirs last because I got a lot more stuff from them. I got this bag, a mystery bag of stones. So we're gonna open that up and see what's in them. She had some grab bags, so This looks like an amethyst. See it? It's gray and purple. Hopefully it's catching the light. I'm not sure if I'm getting the light or not. It's hard to tell with my phone. So if I'm not, I apologize. And I've just done a whole bunch. Look at this. It's a strawberry shaped. Stone. I don't know all the stone names and I'm not even going to try to act like I know them. <laughs> I don't. This looks like an amethyst. It's a heart. I don't know what this is. There's so many stones. I don't even... And then I'll know some and then I'll forget them. And and then there's different names. And, you know, there'll be agates. But there'll be, you know, a whole bunch of names before it. And, yeah. Stones are a hard thing. Oh, I like this one. Aqua blue. I just like them to have them. I think they're just pretty. This is a light purple. A lot of people craft with them, but I just, I don't know. Maybe I will, but I just like them. Like this one I'll put with a necklace. This has a bale on it, but look, it's a little heart. I love that. And I think I got the $18 bag. I think this is an $18 bag on this one. She had 18 and some other. Um, there's some three little. And I know people do wire things, but I just like them in a bowl. <laughs> I don't, they don't have to even be anywhere. And in certain, um, you can look online, certain stones help with certain, certain things, I guess. It's a purple one. Everything purple, I say amethyst, so I don't even want to. When you, all of a sudden you, you start playing with stones, you start, you know, knowing them and then I don't play with them on for a while and then I forget the names. And just because it's black doesn't mean it, you know, it could be jet, it could be honest, it could be just something. A dark agate, it, there's so many things it could be. 
I like just the colors of them. Nothing better than nature, right? Perfectly imperfect, but it's beautiful. Okay, little pieces. I might craft with these, who knows, because I do like stones, so if I make something, this is a little feather. I'd like to put that in a little craft thing, you know what I mean, like a surprise stone. This one, I don't know what this is. It's something, but let me see. It looks like a squid, <laughs> I'm not sure. So that goes there. Ooh, that's pretty. Um, oh, this is a spinner necklace, oops. I think that's why I never realized it. I like bracelets, I think I like to like move them around on my wrist, you know what I mean? But look at this, it's a spinner necklace. Uh, um, whoops. Look. Oh yeah, that would be dangerous. But if you're nervous, like you could just play with your jewelry. I like this. Yeah, they have a lot, they do a lot with stones and she knows a lot with the stones. Like I said, the more you do it. Oh, this is a little apple. Just put a little apple. Um... A heart. Look at the variations and variegation or whatever they call it. Look at it. It's so pretty. I just hope it's showing up because when I look at my camera, I can't see anything that I'm doing. <laughs> and I wonder why I can't get my watch time hours up. And another little heart. See, I love the imperfect. like I say imperfections. You know what I mean? That makes it distinct and it's beautiful. The ones that have pendants, I mean, it has... But the I, bales I will make into necklaces. <clears throat> and a few more little chips. And, oh my goodness. <laughs> it's supposed to look like a spoon ring. Get it? Like, but it's tiny. It's not real spoon. You know what I mean? It's, and I don't know what stone that is. She'd know, too. She's really good with them. And this is an adjustable ring with a little purple stone. I'm going to give that to the, the granddaughter. I don't know how big that is. I'll have to see how big it is. But, and then there is... I think this is a bracelet, but I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> yep, yeah, a bracelet. Very pretty. I don't know if it's just silver tone or if it's silver. It feels kind of silvery. Oh, let's see. It says S925. Okay, well, I'll have to check it, but beautiful. I like that for myself. I like dainty jewelry, even though like I feel like I have man hands, but yeah. So that was in that bag. And then I got... Um, it's the chakras, and each one of these have a little bag. It tells the different chakras, like your heart, chakra, your head, all that sort of thing. And they actually gave me a link to an online, To I haven't looked at it yet, to um, find which one you have. It's supposed to help with your chakras. I would think that was the third eye. I'm not sure. I'm guessing. All right, so each one has a bag. Let me just pull them out. That's how many? Two, four... Six, seven, seven chakras. Oh, I should put them on here. Yeah, so they give me a li link to know what they're for. They're almost like a worry stone for me, too. Like, that'd be... I know they, um, when my stepdaughter was younger, she had, like, they got her a worry stone. You know what I mean? Just... Look at that one. And a purple... Who doesn't need help with their chakras? <laughs> the green. I like the colors, too. Like I said, even if you put it in a bowl, and then once I learn which one, I can hold. Look at that one. So, yeah. So that's Jen's. That's Treasure Hustlers. And that's Barbie's. So, that's this haul. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching, guys. See you at the next one. Bye.